Right, morning sports. Morning sports fans, it's Thursday morning. It's half past five in the morning. I've just got back from Turkey. New set of Ashes. So we're obviously going to make it to I guess say it. Uh, yeah, we landed back yesterday morning. I landed in Leeds, Bradford yesterday morning at about, what time did I land yesterday? For half three, drove home. And then uh, drove home and literally unpacked kids away from bed. Now we're straight to work yesterday. It's half five this morning today. I was in the office at half five yesterday. Dale rang me while I was away calmly and said that he was going all day, got last minute flight. So it, it just is what it is. It's time of the year. You know, summer holidays are upon us. We're quickly closing up to September, which is when it's back to manic season again. So I think everyone's just trying to condense holidays and get them in, like I say. But what we're saying. So yeah, today I'm in LA. I've got to get a few things in place. Got a couple of my mates and subcontractors today on site doing what's doing. Got to head to one of our other sites that's been going for a while now, Tramby, you'll have seen some really posh designer bathrooms. So I'm back getting them complete today with the lads there. Frank is in, he's back off all day as well. So it's nice to start getting the team back together and done. We've recently just finished a couple of kitchen refurbs and stuff, so we've got quite a lot of materials left over. Just need to really get rid of this now and have a good push and get a bit of a good clean up done. So, uh, be a manic one. I'm working Saturday. I don't want to be able to honest, but there's just not a lot I can do. It's just literally shut down week, shut down week for the rest of the week, whatever. So it's just a little bit crazy. But look, nevertheless, we're winning. Keep going, hustlers. Got to get the van moved now, get my van loaded up, ready to go, get sorted. Uh, start to back at work. I don't like being work. I think that's the biggest bonus about anything. If you enjoy, enjoy your job, you'll never work a day in your life. But, what are you like pliers? What are you saying, lad? <laughs> you idiot. Where are you over it? Shame of God's sake. What are you saying to the fans, Connor? Rather use my hands. I'd rather use my hands on it. What they call them, George? <laughs> Shit, mate. <laughs> 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 Shit, mate. <laughs> Do you want to fill us in then where we're at and what we're doing? Because obviously, uh, I've been off, off for a while. So just show how new The fans don't know why I've been off, but they don't need to. Come on, show him. Show him all the apprentice holds fit so look. He's clueless. You don't have toilets in Leicester, does he? He's just on the street, bro. Mate, you want to be careful because the fans will be getting older, yeah? No. So, got any fans from Leicester? Quite a few, mate, yeah? Block them. <laughs> this is the one that was out on Friday for quite a long time. Teeth, mate, weeds, it's off. Okay. This. This. Frank is in as well, right, Frank? Yeah. Say now in fans. Frank. So, going on over to Connor now, and he's going to tell you what we're doing. So, he's got toilet in situ. What else is going down, Connor? Second victim, got toilet, walking basin, unit, vanity. Uh, and we've got a free standing. Right, we're bored of him already. Hello, I'm boring, <laughs> So, what we've had to do, trying to be safe now, I know. <laughs> Behind me, popping poppers. That's it, uh, I've had to cut the skating out and multi tool because this is a back to all pan. So, that's cut now. I'm gonna hand over to the lads, they're gonna get that done. Tell you what, not a bad cut for me, is it? Let's ask the fans a question, who's got better teeth? It's more good. Well, who's a five grand then, who's a three? Who's got a bag of what's it still in the mouth? <laughs> <laughs> the coffin, man. Sink's in the coffin. Lovely yeah, sink, that yeah, one. Still George is going that one, eh? And that? Yeah. Back on Do when you're done, do you want to put it in that when you finish today? Yeah, you might just send me to America or something. <laughs> I'm not Got a video, <laughs> I've got a video with America. Two little holes there to your eyes and the little mouth, little glory hole. Sorry, just so I can vape. Those are big then. arms, lad, aren't you, aren't you? Well, you're doing your job, look. Well, you lift it up, you should smash it. You're doing your job, So, Tay, do you get two, did you? Yeah, yeah. Right, do you want to set us one up down there, mate? And then what we're going to do, we're going to export all the tools out of here. Put them on the dust sheet there if you don't mind, mate, just so we're nice and tidy. So we're protecting the floors and then we can lift the vanity unit and then I can look at getting down. Is that real heavy, Connor? Mm. Oh, it's not too bad. I thought it was like mega heavy. Is that a chip there? It's heavy enough. It's a little chip there, look. Bit yeah, to be fair. Has it got one of them backboards or not? Splash yeah. Sounds. That is a unit and half, isn't it? Mm. Right, this is where we're at, lad. Where are we at? Tell us, Georgie. You've done absolutely nout today. I've done everything. Got the vanity on the wall, just finished it then. Peace, that innit? I don't know what he's doing. He's been. How long's he been there for now in that corner? Three hours, isn't it? But I'm done. You're not done. Yeah! <laughs> <You're not done. laughs> <You're not done. laughs> We've just repainted this full house. I'm in level, mate. Yeah, it is. That's bang on. Done, sorted. It's in a bit. Bang on, level. Done. We're coming for him now, can't we? Connor, are you feeling strongly tonight, or what? 
The uh, just come in, Connor. The sinker, what lad? I want to see George lift it. George, come on. He'll go full floor. Careful, yo. He put it back to front, no. Yeah, I know. Yeah. <laughs> Get that sound. I'm going to start, like, throw it at the water, mate. That's fried. <laughs> 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 you went, don't know what you did. <laughs> 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 Tell you what, mate. Job and half that. Isn't it? Walls out, though, that noise. Not like, what's that walls out there? But it's what it is, isn't it? It's not not Mazzy Watts, though. <laughs> That's not so bad. What are we saying, lads? It's not bad, man. Frank, what do you think? You're not even looking, you're looking at the floor. Yeah, yeah, is he? Right, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to start up, get out of here. Lads are uh, done, to be fair. I've only popped this morning to give a... Uh, You've got an action. I'll get that sorted. Just pop to uh, set the gaffer up. Get this uh, bespoke tap. Is it, what's the first fix like on that? Oh, oh mate, don't mind that. I've done it, mate, that's why. Brilliant, so elbow Brilliant. straps to that, don't sort of trap. You came here and you just, you just disconnected the old flexing as it is. Mate, them taps, mate, are weird, aren't they? Oh, I've got that one. Yeah, fine. Smack. Hang on, though, they've done that and say white. Oh, it wants white, though, doesn't it, lads? Smack that, though. Yeah, looking well, lads, looking well. Just looking good. Yeah, just what I'll do. I'll fold it up. Yeah, just get that in that box. Frankie, lads, I sprung that in the box, mate. Just watch, got mask on in the middle of it. This is where job was made because your video it's like George shot watching, don't you? Yeah, come on, George. I'm just sure he's, he's alright. I feel his head coming off. <laughs> so, this is Apprentice Wars. George. You all got a high rack at the business now. Tell us what you're doing right now. Just teaching us flat pack a box. <laughs> <laughs> Is that the level you've achieved, BD? Two years you've already done a flat pack a box. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, I don't get taught, do I? <laughs> yeah. I get put in the slums. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, lad. Yeah, right, so the lads are cracking upstairs. There's for the client now, just discussing about obviously the position of the basin and the toilet. So, what I've done now is this little hole I've caught, and I've been very lucky because I forgot the measurement, I'll be honest with you, but I kind of gauge by eye where it was. It's a cast iron stack inside of there, so I'll just whip out. We're not sponsored by them yet. They did message me on Instagram, but I'm just going to go for it. I'm just, I'm going to go for it. I'm going to say, listen, Milwaukee, do you want to sponsor us? We don't want nothing, we just want some tools for free, and we'll just promote them because we love Milwaukee. What I've done is I've drilled a hole there. And then luckily for me, I found where the bung is because these drains got blocked and it is a cast iron stack there and that stack is still in use. So what I've got to do from screw fix, I've just picked up one of these. It's a little trap door. I'm going to have to pop that onto there like that. But what I'm going to have to do is cut that lip down on there so it slides past onto there. And I have to cut these out so it sits into the wall nice and tidy. So a little bit tedious, but let's go. So I've had to butcher that. To make it work, I'll have to put a bit of mastic in there. Ooh, it's tight in there. Yeah, I'll get a bit of a sealant to stick that there. Mm, I'll take them off that, I'm not happy with that. Just literally taking them off there. And then that door should, drop door should just sit in. So what I'm gonna do with this, no messing about, just literally. It will be one there. I'm not gonna go too mad with it, because obviously when it's on the wall, I don't want it flexing everywhere. Just pull a little bit there, I think, as well. You know what I'm like, guys? All strands do a good job. So let's stick this on now. Yeah, just show the client that I've got a trap actually installed. It's been meaning to go in for a while, this, but I've got honest, I've got the measurement, uh, give it a stab in. Hey, press the off, we're there, we'll get it tied up. Put that back and then I'll be out of here. Site meeting, then meet our sub is on site where we're crafting another site for us. So we're busy, busy, Dale's and all day. I'm gonna leave that. But if you look, some wheel picking there's a box, it's protruding by about oh, a mil, but it's behind the door, new to it. just wants to be accessible and tap the. I should just be able to. You little bugger. 
Look at that, can you believe that? Well done. Fill the two hands up, mate, that sounds so. Yeah, that's for me, sir. tired of this now, mate. The sink looks really nice, doesn't it? Look at that. I've that to collect, you know, but I'll set the Oh, smart that, mate. It's the only thing. Are you imagining that? No, just leave that like that for now. What's going on with that? No, but... Oh, yeah. That's fine. You're still doing that, though, because someone's done it. He did this the other day on another thing he did for me. The waist was too tight. So it's... Well, I don't know, mate, but it's all right. That's got it now. It's hard, though. Flexes away along on that. Uh, so yeah, that's fine then, no problem. That looks good, nice and tidy job that mate. Is there a top to go on that as well, bud? On there, Where is it? On my pocket. On there? Yeah, there will be. We'll leave it like that for now, because it wants to get decorated, leave it in there and that can go on after to cut it. So I've got to put lights and stuff on, bath knees fitting, but to be fair mate, we smashed about doors like this, don't we? Oh, that's it, the job done. Complete, Thank God. Now it's not been a bad job, it's just it really has, really has dragged on massively. The toilet looks well as well, nice job with the toilet. It's just it is what it is and that we can do. It's because it's a pop thing on top, mate, and the club ends with Yeah, not cheap. Right, so we leave the lads to it now. Connor's got this radiator fit downstairs and when we're back, some point in the very, very near future, this needs fitting. So yeah, I'm sick of this because I'm just like... That's it and all the way season, isn't it? Friday morning, we're out the yard. Big man's with me. So obviously, yeah, uh, Frank is starting the job now. Uh, but he's just doing bits and bats for me days while I'm in because I'm off again next week. And it just doesn't make sense why. And obviously, Connor having two lads and it's not worth it. Got we're subbing Craig at the moment as well with Scott. So we're busy. Few man on the force field. Just time of the year, obviously, school shut down, things like that. Is what it is. But anyway, you don't want to know me ins and outs. You want to know what we're doing today. Today, me, the man, the myth, Frankie. I'm so scared of that neck. Lovely car. Uh, I've got a shower valve to repair this morning. So, in a nutshell, the conditions go like this. Customs got a mullet point. All the tap outlets on the taps are running fine. The mullet point's not that old as well. Uh, and what's happening is when they run the shower, it's going intermittent, hot and cold. And going to need to give the shower a strip down service. It hasn't been touched for six years. Just to make sure that the temperature mix inside is all okay, do what it should do. Because I think that could be creating a problem. Because when I'm on the hot water and all the tap outlets, it's running absolutely fine. So I'm hoping that resolves it. But we're going to get in there, get it done, and get it cracked on. I'll we'll test it on the base, Sid, because you can see that that's running. Small as. And what I'm going to do, I don't know if I can test that. It's mad, isn't it? That was working mint and then it broke. This is what it That's been one in the pool right now <coughs> for. I don't know how long. It's not red hot though, it's red hot that, it's a little bomb if you ask me. The temperature turned like that one as well, I'll put a little bit more in. That was turned like that one, the temperature. Hey? It's very hot though. It's got a beard cut today, I mean, cut what? Teeth, mate. Show your teeth. Yeah, I can say that now because I've got teeth. Say to someone, like, show me your teeth then. It's not like that. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll take that all day long, mate. So, things like this cause problems, so. Yeah, thanks for zooming in, that's great focusing on what I need you to look at. But anyway, in that, the camera's not focusing, as you'll see. That is just in the tap on the. Bath. Much better flow, right? I'm thinking if we've got debris like that in there, has that got onto the shower cartridge? Hence why that's dropping off because I think that what the shower's doing is it's reaching temperature too quick, shutting off on there, it's getting too hot for the and going off. Hence why I want to give the cartridge a clean out on that. Because now the bath taps are nice and free.
So it's going on off that. Cause I've got that set now midway, that should still be on. That ain't giving me maximum heat, that. With that head, but when I'm on a tap, like that, that water's nice and hot and that stays on a full floor. So what we'll do, we'll get this head strips off now, strip the cartridge out. Cause on me. Right, so what I've done, this issue here is, the multi-point when I've arrived, like I said today, is that is set at minimum setting. So I can turn it up, it can go to maximum like that. And you will see the flame increase. So if I look at there, you've got maximum flame now. If I ramp that down, you can just see the flame start to decrease. It's in the lowest setting. I've now got that in its lowest setting. Nothing else is running. The shower's running. I've adjusted all the temperature bits and stuff in there, just a little click on bits and stuff to allow that to be wet comfortably now. So that is running at maximum rate on that. Then obviously when you turn it down, it still blends. So if you remember before, what we had there. So 90 degree. Angle, she's still running. 180 degree angle from there to there, she's still running. So that makes me a very, very happy engineer. What were you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'll brutally be honest here, if it weren't Frankie, I would not have done this job because he's literally just come into there and said, Look, mate, I've worked on these in my past life, let me. So I was like buzzing there. Yeah. So I'll do a couple more checks now, obviously, just check that the multi point is always doing, and then in all honesty, we're out of here. And that's me done, guys. It is now oh, four o'clock. I'm in the office. I've got the lads out on site grafting. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know to finish a few bits off. I'll be just got in our pause on the I've got Craig and Scott on the on another site doing bits and bats, getting some pallets and stuff done. So, yeah, it's been a busy week. And again, I can't stress enough how hard it is without the man, the myth. It's uh, frustrating. But look, people entitled to holidays, it is just time of the year as well. I'm looking forward to him getting back. He's back on Wednesday next week, so all is well. So again, I brought to be honest with you as well. What is going on with that floor? And little chip in it. Content obviously is going to keep going. You know we don't give up. It ain't a one night mission. This is a mission for life, and we're going to keep at it. Got to keep pushing it out there, like I say. Uh, inevitably, I was looking at Central Eat King's post today, and if you haven't already, damn. Central Eat King, go give him a subscribe and a follow. He does bits of jobbing and decent jobs as well, so go check him out. He's a good geezer, good guy, go check him out. Touching base on, obviously, this time of year, I always look at my analytics. Uh, I used to look at my analytics last year as well. This time of year, I used to get a bit disheartened by it in relation to thinking like, uh, God, not a lot of views and yada, yada, yada. But you've got to think about it, guys. It's summer. People are not sitting in watching TV. They're out enjoying the British weather. In the pub like that so like i say come september time bang you know it picks up again so for all you youtubers out there that are wanting to have a go uh youtubers that are thinking of doing it and youtubers that do do it keep at it keep banging on that door i can't stress enough we're over seven thousand subscribers now I want to say a big thank you to all the fans out there you know it doesn't go unnoticed we have monetized the channel i'm not taking nothing out of it yet because i don't know how to do it but obviously the money is invested in good ways i am hopeful looking this year that we can look at employing apprentice uh media person just to basically help with the day-to-day -day viewing because again i like doing the video and it is good but it does take its toll sometimes you know i cope with it but she's trying to obviously get the job done and some of the jobs are taken on lately they're so demanding in relation to where uh, how can i put this systems and processing design them so my brain sometimes is like in focusing mode on that and sometimes i don't get as much content as i like but again as always guys we hope you like the content we hope you like the brands and if you don't, unsubscribe, don't follow. We don't care. We're going to keep doing it anyway. Respect hustlers and we will see you next week.